Saturday, February 2nd, 2019. The time, 3.07 p.m. 911. Okay, what's going on there? Uh, I was just assaulted by a bunch of people. They're threatening to kill me, and then they chased me with their cars, and they're blocking the road. I okay, how many down. people? Uh, at least five. Okay, where are they at now? They were threatening to beat the hell out of me and kill me, so I had to pull it. I, had, I didn't point my gun at them, but I had it in my hand. Okay, do you need any kind of medical attention? No, I have to go back and get my car. They wouldn't let me pass the property. You said they're... Yeah, I went and parked okay. at a, I'm parked at 248 North Stockton, and then I ran home through the forest. Do you know these individuals? Yeah, they've been stalking and harassing me for, for almost a whole year now. Oh, okay. It's a long history. Any weapons involved? Um, the one guy told me he had a gun and he was about to shoot me with it. Okay, and so how did they assault you? Um, I drove by to go get my mail, and on the way back, the guy hopped in his truck and he backed up, and he was going to block my path because it's the only—it's a dead end road. I can't have to. There's no other way on. So I drove up a neighbor's driveway and I waited for him, and he just sat there. And then eventually he came and he started yelling at me and saying he was going to hurt me, and then he started he getting closer see and closer. He a weapon, correct? No, he was just making verbal threats, and then he uh, started to walk away and he turned around and he came pretty much like sprinting at my car to, you know, come after me and wanting to attack me. And so, so they, they didn't I, actually attack you, correct? No, they didn't touch me. I was, I had oh. a gun in my hand that they were going to. They were, he came after, he did come after me and try to hit me with his truck. I have that on video too. Okay. Any, anyone under the influence of drugs or alcohol? Prob probably, yes, all of them. And it was the same subject that had a gun that came after you with the truck? The, yeah, he, he told me he had, like, his name's Eddie Rhodes, the third. They're probably vandalizing my car right now, too. And do you know about how old he is? Um, about my age, in his 40s. Okay. Maybe early 40s. Okay. Nobody called 911 on this? Okay, and did you say your vehicle was parked at the 251 Stockton? No, it's at, it's at 248 at a, across the street. Blocking their driveway, I have to go back and get it, but I can't go by there without, you know. Oh, okay, and what's your last name, sir? Walton. First name? Ian. And your date of birth? Oh, okay, and so you said when the subjects went after you, you just showed, displayed your gun, you didn't point it at them? No, I pointed at the ground. I was sitting in my car, and he was approaching my car. And he was, you know, I locked the door and had the window rolled up and everything, and he started screaming, oh, you got a gun, you got a gun. And, you know, he's, these people have been threatening me for like 17 years, or at least 15 years now. Uh, okay. So if Eddie Rhodes doesn't have a gun, did say he had a gun on him, so you might want to be concerned about that. Okay. And so both of the individuals, Eddie and both have guns? I have a felon. He's not allowed to have gun, but he, guns, but he probably does somewhere. Um, but Eddie told me he had a gun, and he had his okay. hand in his waistband. He told me he was going to shoot me. I didn't, you know, he was trying to get me to put my gun away, but I wasn't going to put my gun away if they were anywhere near me. But you didn't actually see one cracked? No, no. But he did tell me, you know, he, he said, I'm a and I'm about to shoot you while he's blocking my path. Where's your gun at? Uh, it's on my holster right now. Okay. Do you carry that on your head? Yeah, it's open carry. I don't have a, I don't have a permit. 
I'll put it up as soon as the officers arrive. Okay. okay. And you still have that on your hip, correct? Yes. Oh, okay. And it's just a one gun? Mine? Yes. Yeah. In your avenue address? Yes. Do you have an ETA? I'd like to get my property before they destroy it. Oh, I guess no. it's not life threatening, but if I go back, they're going to come after me again. Yeah, no, I already have the information over. Uh, you don't have a knife, do you? A knife? No. Yeah. And what was the address that you had to leave your vehicle at? 248. I begged them to call 911 and they completely ignored me. Okay. What color is your vehicle? It's a white Honda. And is it a sedan, SUV, pickup truck? A uh, hatchback. Okay. Are you inside at the... Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm just updating our deputies, okay? I don't have any, necessarily have any further questions, but I do want to stay on the line with you for now. What's your home address? So you went to the 248 and asked the residents there to call and they didn't? Yeah, they refused, unless you got a call from them. I begged them for about two minutes to call. They just walked away. And I just want to confirm you're not injured at all? No. Actually, we got a neighbor out there. Maybe he'll go with me to go get my car. Okay. Well, right now I just want you to stay where you're at, okay? I know you're concerned about okay. your okay. car, maybe but... I can, can I give him the car keys and ask him to go get it? Well, we don't want to put him in any kind of harm's way either at this yeah. time, okay? No, he's, they're, they're after me. They're not after him. He's, okay. he's got a relationship with them. Oh, but, you, but you never okay, know, and okay. we don't want to put somebody okay. else in harm's way, okay? okay? Well, I know you're very you concerned then. about your vehicle, but we just want you to hang tight so that no one gets okay. in harm's way. And you don't know the names of any of the other individuals? No. They're all on drugs, though. I can tell you that for 100% certain. Okay. Do you know what kind of drugs? Um, mostly there they use meth and ecstasy and a lot of cannabis and alcohol. Mostly mess that they do, though. Okay. This is a dispatch in Salem? It is. Okay. Well, then you wouldn't know the local officers. Are they known to have any weapons, aside from what they yes, were Yes, yes. Lots, lots and lots of weapons. And the guy's a felon, and he... Um, Okay, is this Eddie got, or... He's got cases. He's got felonies pending on him. I'm not, probably not supposed to you talk know, about it. Do you know what kind of weapons? Handguns, usually. Do you know where he keeps them? Uh, I'd have them. If I knew, I would, I would. he would have been in prison a long time ago. Okay. Mm. You, and you didn't point the gun at anyone, you just pointed it towards nope, the ground? Um, at the ground, at the ground the whole time. Okay. They were filming me, so they, they are they are going to claim that I did point the gun at them, but I didn't. And um, one of them actually made a, the same claim um, out less than a week ago, and I have that all on camera too, so I don't know why they're not arresting them for initiating false reports, but they, I guess they're working on a bigger case or something. Which doesn't help me much. Do you have the sun footage as well? Um, I had the dash cam going in the car, so it's facing forward. I was too freaked out to, you know, get the other. I had two of them with me, but um, yeah, um, the audio should be where he's, you know, coming up to the car and saying, "I'll, you know, I'll, I'll, whatever you're saying, I'll kill you. I'll beat, I'll beat you to." I think he said he's gonna beat me to a pulp and then run me over with his truck or something. Something okay. to that effect. And you still have your firearm holstered? Yeah, 
I, I can I, put it away if you want. Yeah, if you're can, able to, can here. you go, yeah. like, put it up yeah. in your room or in your safe, wherever you keep it? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's not on me anymore. Okay, so where is it at? Have it. It's in my bedroom. Is it locked up or just laying in your bedroom? I don't have it. I don't have a gun safe or anything. Okay. I can, I can, you know, as soon as I know they're coming, I can um, unload it if you, if that makes you feel better. Um, yeah. If, do you, can you unload it now? Well, as soon as I feel safe, I don't really feel safe right now. Okay. Are they in the area? I mean, yeah, there is, we've got a lot of deputies headed that way now. Okay, um, yeah. So I just want you to keep your gun in your room, and we'll be making contact with you as soon as we can. If anything changes before okay. then, just let us know. Yeah, it's, it's unloaded. All right, thank you. Okay. Bye-bye. All right, bye.